In this video, I'm going to be working out an individual integral. For the most part, this is um, really a straightforward integral, but it's going to have um, become a lot simpler if you use log rules before you start your integration here, so that's why I chose to do this example. All right, right here we've got the log of 2 times e raised to the sine x. All right, I've got a multiplication here. I can expand this uh, function with my log rules, so I'm going to write down here, use log rules, okay, because that's what we're going to want to do. We're going to want to expand that function, expand that log function, and then we'll be able to integrate as separate integrals here. So I'm going to have the integral. All right, multiplication of logs means I can expand with an addition. So I'm going to have natural log of 2 plus natural log of e raised to the sine x and then dx. So I've just taken this log expression, expanded it into two individual logs with the addition sign in between. And I am integrating that entire quantity. Now I'm going to break it up and integrate them individually. So I'll have the integral of natural log of 2 dx plus the integral of natural log of e raised to the sine x dx. All right, now what we're going to do here is we're going to take a look at this and then realize that the natural log of 2 is just a constant. So I'm going to pull that out in front. So I'm going to have natural log of 2 times the integral of, I'm going to go ahead and put it in there, 1 dx plus. Now we're going to take a look at this. Natural log of e raised to the sine x can be simplified. Natural log of e is just 1. So you know, jumping the frog, doing all that kind of stuff, we're going to be left with just a sine x there. So the integral of sine x dx. Straightforward integral here, straightforward integral here. So then I'm going to have natural log of 2. Integrating 1 dx will give me an x, plus integrating um, sine there will give me a negative cosine x, and then I can put that plus c on there, and then that's a little tacky right there. So let's go natural log of 2 times x minus cosine x plus c. Okay, so in all honesty, a straightforward integral there, uh, but to help get started there, you've got to recognize that you've got a log function, and you can implement those log rules, do some expansion there, and it's going to make the integration um, a lot simpler. Definitely, thanks for watching. If the videos are helping, don't forget to share with your friends and subscribe to the channel. Thanks.